have the same struggles. Actually, mm. I have a really embarrassing story. Oh. I can share it. It's the girls' talk. Tell, tell. It's girls' talk. This was in, in middle school. <laughs> mm. You know, you're in middle school. You're going through puberty. Mm. Everything is hard. Mm. Life is hard. Mm. I had... Well, you know, you grow hair on your body in yes. puberty. Yes. I had grown some hair on my arm. Oh my god, as I'm so do. relates to this story. I'm gonna so relate, sister. Let's go. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> you know, it happens. You have hair on your arms. Yes. And then um, I was in middle school and I, I never thought about the hair on my arms, really. I didn't give it a second thought. But I was in school. I was in class. I was wearing short sleeves. <gasps> and this guy in my class looks at me, looks at my arm hair and says, Dang, Fauna, you the man! <gasps> oh, yeah, I'm good! I was, I was so mortified, <gasps> so embarrassed. Mm. But actually, there was such a nice person there who came to my defense and was like, That's messed up, don't say that. Thank and I was you, so person. thankful to that person for defending me. Thank Otherwise, you. I don't know, I might have been crushed for the rest of my life. But I did, after that, never wear short sleeves again until I learned... <laughs> I don't like to shave my arms. Mm. I don't know. That just feels weird to me. Instead, I use like um, it's kind of like sandpaper, but just really soft sandpaper, and Whoa. I just like use it and buff the hair Whoa. away, and it gets rid of the hair. Oh. Really? Well, Fana, and then I could wear short sleeves again. <laughs> Fana, I'm so happy that you shared this story because I have a very similar one. 